I should be able to find the tools I need here. I hope so too, because I'm not in the mood to just take a hot ass minute just to find shit. Nothing. This is so lame. Bitch, you haven't even moved anything, bro. This is Lover of Ladies. Thank you for tuning in to this week's Life is Strange. Chloe's stepdad is head of security at Blackwell. He wants to put surveillance cameras all over the school? How paranoid can you get? I'm just here struggling to find simple tools for the camera that was broken. Appreciate the love and support, by the way. Chloe's stepfather is this asshole from Blackwell? You've got to be shitting me. And he's an army veteran. Thank you for your service. Ooh. Hmm. One of these guns is missing. I hope Chloe's stepdad isn't packing heat. I hope so, too. Yes, score. I really hope, well, actually, I do hope he has the gun, because if it's anyone else besides him, that will be a problem. What the hell is this? Wowzer, a map of Blackwell Academy. I wonder why. Maybe he wants to keep the campus a lot more safe? Hold on. Should I switch the song? Decision. What the? Chloe's stepdad actually installed cameras in the rooms? For reals? This guy has serious trust issues. Do Chloe and Joyce even know about this? All right, I want to see exactly where all the cameras are at. Yo, in the bedroom? In his bad bedroom. Okay, but as soon as I see the bathroom or clothes, that's it. Instant report. I don't know how I feel about having him put the camera in his and Joyce's bedroom, though. Like, I really hope they know. I'm going to close this up. I'm not trying to leave any trace that I found something. And I see some tools there, but I see other stuff here as well so these are way too big i need tiny tools for that camera okay boom precision screwdrivers except i can't reach them that does not look stable so let's make it unstable some more That was very smart, dumbass. No can reach. That is so rude. Don't try yes, and insult some me. Ancient cardboard. Look at you talking shit about any little thing. Man, I should have done that before they fell. Okay. Okay, here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna unwind everything so Max can just stop talking shit. All right, hopefully, let me see. Okay, so the tools are up there. I'm going to go and push this thing in, right? So by the time I do turn on the washing machine, the tools are going to fall down below and onto the cardboard. There you go, baba booey, baba booey. Now you can stop talking shit. Yes, you have mad skills, Max. Okay, let's go and search some other area. No password. Like it would help me find tools anyway. This must belong to Chloe's stepdad. Ooh, another cardboard. No, not cardboard. Um, cabinet for me to open. Just some food, I guess. 
I wonder what's in those files up there. Let's look and see. Shit! <gasps> Butterfingers! Oh, never mind. A picture? Let me look. Kate Marsh? Why the hell would he have pictures of her? Okay, this is getting totally weird. Oh. Oh. That's a close-up and a half. Okay, you know what? Let me rewind all of this. There you go. There you go. See? There you go. And we're not going to look, but it's pretty creepy how he has pictures of her. I don't know why, but whatever. Look at all that food. That's like enough spam for a hundred years. Actually, for me, that would last me a month. Oh, I forgot about this. Yeah, th this would last me for a couple months. Check out the muscle car. Chloe's stepdad must be a gearhead. Yeah, must be. I don't know. We're just gonna leave this store um open like that. That's pretty crazy. Whatever. I guess we're back to. S Ooh, what's this? I love that they have the same old answering machine. And there's a message. Chloe, if you're listening, Pete was cruising home off duty and told me he saw you near that garbage dump. Now I've ordered. Told you. To stay away from that place, it's dangerous. And you got no idea what kind of scum are living out there. Stay away. I'm serious. Wow, he looks so concerned. I mean, he sounds concerned. Bendito. All right, let's go upstairs. Hey, are you done smoking yourself to death, bro? I got the tools, so I'm gonna go and... Uh... You found the tools. Sweet. You can sit at my desk and fix your camera. Oh, cute. A little montage of me just working carefully. Why are you stressed, bro? It's just a camera. Chloe, help her. She's so? about to cry. I can't fix this thing. Are these your new photos? Yeah, I just took them today. Let me see. Booyah, you skank. Karma's a bitch. Nice framing, too. Wait, I've seen this before. Uh, no way. When did you take this? You took mm. this photo, you brat? In why am I a brat? Today, you set off the alarm. That's why Nathan raged after you. It totally makes sense. You hella saved my life. Now tell me the truth, Max. I was there, hiding in the corner. Damn, yep. You are a ninja. A ninja would have cut Nathan's head off. I just took a butterfly photo. That is so badass. Oh yeah, I almost wet myself when I saw the gun. Dead ass. So, did you recognize me? Not at all. Your hair and clothes are so different. I hope so. I'm sure this is all so weird to you after coming back. Like you said, it's been that kind of day. So you must have overheard our conversation. Mm, yeah, I did. Dead ass. I didn't know you like do any of extracurricular drug activities. Just a bit. There is no way you didn't hear every single vowel. Okay, I only heard something about money, drugs, but that's it. Now for the big question. Did you tell anybody? Absolutely. Nathan Prescott had a fucking gun on you. Gutless prick. How scary. Who did you tell? The principal. But he didn't seem to believe me. He's useless. The principal? Are you still 12? That drunk jackass only cares about cash for Blackwell Academy. Don't trust him. Okay. I didn't mention you at all. Swear. Thank God. I'll tell you more someday. And I seriously owe you, Max. Ooh. 
What are you looking for? I uh, know it was your birthday last month. Yeah. This was my real father's camera. I want you to have it. That's oh so my cool. God, you my birthday, bro. But I can't take this. Of course you can. My dad would be pissed if I never used it, and now I know it'll be used awesomely. And Aww. I'll snag this picture as a symbol of our reunion. Cool? Yes, of course it's cool. Thank you. This camera is so sweet. Wow. Now that we get that mushy shit out of the way, I feel like stage diving. Let's thrash this place. You're crazy. Yep, yep, I'm fucking insane in the brain. Let's dance. Shake that bony white ass. Or <laughs> take my picture with your new camera. Did she say? <laughs> did she then I say? <laughs> Shake your bony white ass. I am so of uh, that's my 13th reason. This day couldn't get any stranger. All right, so obviously, even though the stereo is on, I had to turn down the music because I'm not trying to get copy claims. So I'm gonna insert my own interpretation of the rock music Chloe is uh listening. <clears throat> All right, that's it. Nice. Can't dance, hippie? Come on. Rock out, girl. First of all, you call me a bony yes, white ass. Break it down, Max. And now, hippie. Chloe, are you up there? Yo, oh, turn it shit. Off. Turn it off. Oh, shit. Dude, the music's not even on! Asshole. I'm coming up. We need to talk. Oh, no fucking way. You need to hide now. My stepdad will kill me if he finds you here. Chloe, what's going on? Open this door, please. Chill, I'm changing. Is that okay? Max, find a place to hide now. Where am I gonna I'm hide? Gonna Up I'm the not bed. A kid anymore. I can't hide under the I'm bed. Wow. Yes. Hide this the is window. Going nowhere fast. Oh my god. Else. I'm what giving you spots to hide. You I'm Oh my god. Around, Chloe, door. Bro, I am so stressed out. What the fuck am I supposed to do? Okay. Bra is stuck. I'm not screwing. No. Around, Shit. Chloe, open this door. Oh my god. I I don't do well in stressful situations, obviously. Okay. Okay. Hurry up. Oh, come on. Is it good now? now? One Please. second. My bra is stuck. I'm not screwing around. My so God. Cold. Shut up. I don't know why he wants to be in this room so bad. I'm giving you exactly three seconds. Shit. What's going on in here? Jesus, I'm just trying on clothes. You're so friggin' paranoid. Yeah, combat will do that to you. But that doesn't mean you got a bum rush into this chick. One of my room. guns is missing. Did you take it? Oh god, I didn't take your stupid gun. You do know I believe in gun control? Wait, is that grass? You been token up again in here? Oh yeah, guns, weed. You were tripping balls. I'm sick of your disrespect. Tell me the truth. That's an order. Whose is it? Stop treating me and my mom like we're your family platoon. Hey, leave Joyce out of this. I wish you'd leave Joyce, like now. Oh, <gasps> that's fucked up. You're not her dad to be hitting her, you asshole. I care about your mother, and you just keep pushing me. So that means you can hear her, right, you fucking prick? Again, asshole. That's the last time. Or I'll bring the cops in here so fast. You're not that dumb. I'd be smart to have you busted. Chloe, someday you'll grow up. Yo, what the hey, fuck? You okay? Obviously not. Welcome Max. to the real step douches of Arcadia Bay. I'm sorry. For what? He would have been a bigger dick if he caught you in here. That's hard to believe. Anyway, let's sneak out the window. There is one cool place we can go to in this hick hole. David oh. was such a mean bastard to Chloe. 
What if I had stepped up to help? Honestly, let's just leave. Because you even even then, it's not your place to step in, Max. It's not. Honestly, though, if my stepdad were to hit me like that, I would have been crack his face. Me and him would have been duking it out. But, you know, that's just me with my anger issues. Okay, so where are we? Are we in the woods? Like in that same spot where Max had that weird dream? We are! Holy shit! I haven't been here in forever. So why do I feel like I was just here? Because you were here in your oh, dreams, that's why. This is the exact same path I was on during my nightmare today. Exactly. Deja vu. I feel like I'm in my nightmare again. First of all, where is Chloe? And how did we get here anyways? Oh, that's the path. Okay. Ooh, what's this? People can be such pigs. They haven't updated this sign since the 1980s. Arcadia Bay Wildlife Venue. Hello, Oregon nature lovers. Within these woods, you will find a variety of animals, but that doesn't mean they're looking for you. Bears, snakes, coyotes, wolves can be very dangerous. Be careful. Do not feed any animals in the forest. Please stay on the trails and ask a ranger if you need guidance. Graffiti. Don't feed the Sasquatch. They should stay away, white man. What? That's kind of corny. Picture time, because it's a cute bird. I so. got you. Oh. See, look at this. I love it. Alright, so let me just not head out. So I guess this is how... That old fence is part of the landscape now. The path behind it leads to the parking lot. Okay, that totally makes sense then as to the, the layout of the land. Let me go up to the white... the lighthouse. Hello, cute little squirrel. You and me. Stare contest. Why are you so awkward, bro? Anyways. Let me go meet Chloe up in the lighthouse. Use caution on trail. Dangerous drop-offs. Oh, he got messed up. Look at him. Earth to Max, your white knight Warren here. I know you were worried about me. Damn, he ate that punch. I owe you. Thanks for today. I'll call back later, okay? I swear. No problem. And you still have to tell me your big secret. <laughs> okay. Birds are so lucky. They can always escape. Not always, but... Oh my god, I forgot all about this. Too bad I can't rewind that far back. I don't remember this at all, but it seems like it's been here for a long time. Wowzer, Chloe drew that to mark our tree for it. So we'd oh. always be able to find each other in case of emergency. <sighs> well, now you're together, so... What the hell? Looks like the youth of Arcadia Bay still come up here to party. I never made it. How long has that been here? So many graffitis. Clearly. The Bigfoots are everywhere. Can't open this door. Too bad. I would like to see what's inside. Can I open here? Too bad it's locked. I remember racing up and down the steps. Yeah, corny. Alright, well, let me go talk to... 
hello. She's just sitting there. Probably thinking about Mad's shit. Probably thinking about Rachel. This would be a nice photo of Chloe, framed by the sun. You sure you don't want to be alone? Sit down if you want. I'm sorry I wussed out. No worries. I know my step dork can be scary. I'm not as brave as you. And David is indeed a step douche. I'm step sorry douche. you have to experience it firsthand. You have to live with him. Has he always been this way? Ever since my desperate mom dragged his ass to our home, I never trusted David. He freaked out on poor Kate Marsh today. I know her. She's cool. Only that prick would bully her. He has some kind of weird agenda. He has a lot of secret files. Rambo still thinks he's gathering enemy intelligence. Did you take a peek? Well, yeah. I couldn't help it. Cause I'm nosy. Never change. What did you find? Creepy photos of Kate Marsh. Other Blackwell students. This dude takes his job too seriously. He still thinks he's at war or something. He's a total surveillance fetish. There were there spy cams in the house? I knew you didn't know. Chloe, your house is under surveillance. What are you talking about? There are cameras all over the house. I saw it on a monitor in the garage. Yeah, I knew dead it. Ass. He's so hella fucking paranoid. I'll keep this a secret for now. Sometimes ignorance is bliss. No Not wonder in I'm this so case. Miserable. Everybody in this town knows everybody's secrets. Even yours? Not anymore. So what do you have on Nathan? He's an elite asshole who sells bad shit cut with laxative. And he dosed me with some drug in his room. He dosed what? what? I met him in some shithole bar that didn't card me. He was too rich for the place and too wasted and he kept flashing bills. Just tell me what happened, Chloe. Now. I was an idiot. I thought he was so blazed it would be an easy score. You needed money that bad? Actually, yes. I owe big time. And I thought I'd have enough for me and Rachel if she showed up. So, what about you and Nathan? We went to his room at Blackwell. We drank, and I laughed at his rich kid bullshit. He was one step ahead and put something in my beer. Oh no. God, Chloe, I can't believe this. I mean, I do. Then what? Do you I really want to know? I out on the floor. I woke up and that perv was smiling, crawling towards me with a camera. Go on. Everything was a blur. I tried to kick him in the balls and broke a lamp. Nathan freaked, so I managed to bum rush the door and get the hell out. <sighs> Max, it was insane. I'm so angry. That low key sounds like he tried to rape you. I am so furious, I can't even speak. But you are speaking. What did you do then? I figured I would make him pay me to keep quiet. So we met in the bathroom. And he brought a gun. That was Nathan's last mistake. He's still dangerous, Chloe. Not just to you. Oh, good thing you notified the principal. I feel safer already. Damn, I my bad. To save you. you were here today, Max. You saved me. I'm still tripping on that. Seeing you after all these years feels like... Destiny? Destiny's child. Say my name, say my name. When no one is around you, say, baby, I love you. Oh. I mean, this is such a romantic spot, but the moment is not. If this is destiny, I hope we can find Rachel. I miss her, Max. I know you do. This Bendito. shit pit has taken away everyone I've ever loved. I'd like to drop a bomb on Arcadia Bay and turn it to fucking glass. Be careful what you wish for, bro. That shit could come true. Max, are you good? Oh no! Not again! Oh my god, I am stuck here. What the what hell? Is happening to me? I don't know. Why are you asking me? Why are you asking me? So am I supposed to follow that deer? Okay. Still up there? I have 
to find out. So then go and find out. Oh, shit. Ooh. All right, let's go this way because I'm not trying to get killed. Ooh, shit. I almost got killed. Oh, shit. All right, let's go. Move. Yo, I almost got killed twice, bro. Oh my god, this is so... This is so stressful. I don't even want to be here. Why am I following this deer? Ooh. Oh, shit. Fucking deer. Alright, I'm gonna I'm a stand right here. Woo! Yo, what the fuck? Why is everything trying to kill me? This is scary as hell. This is like Final Destination. Oh my lord! The tornado is back! Ooh. Ah. Oh. Alright. What the hell? Yo, what the hell? I need to get away from this. What am I supposed to do? Newspaper? Okay, I know what to do. I'm supposed to be on the other side, so... Come on... Yeah, yeah, whatever. Cool. Oh! This is insane. I don't even want to be here. What does it say, Max? October 11th? Is this Friday? That's only four days away. So right now, we're on a Monday. That tornado is headed straight for the town. Chloe, you're here. I'm back. Oh my lord, this is real, it's real. Oh man, this sucks. Max, what's going on? You totally blacked out. Really? I didn't black out. I had another vision. The town is going to get wiped out by a tornado. Oregon gets about five tornadoes every 20 years. You just zoned. No, no, I saw it. I could actually feel the electricity in the air. Come on, take a breath, okay? Chloe, it's electric. I'm not crazy. But there's something else I have to tell you. Something hardcore. Talk More to me, Max. hardcore than I what? I had the same vision earlier in class. When I came out of it, I discovered I could reverse time. Dun, like dun, I said, dun. Not crazy. But hi? Right? Listen to I me. wish. How do you think I saved you in the bathroom? By reversing time? Yeah, sure. I saw you get shot, Chloe. Dead so ass. You actually die. And it was scary. I was able to go back and hit the fire alarm. Okay, I see you're a geek now with a great imagination, but this isn't anime or a video game. People don't have those powers, Max. I don't know what I have, but I have it. And I'm scared shitless. You need to get high. It's been a hell insane fucking day. It's snowing? What the hell is this? Snowflakes? It's like 80 degrees. How? Climate change. Or a storm is coming. Or climate Max, change. Why not? Start from the beginning. Tell me everything. Oh, now you want to listen. Okay, cool. Let's go back. Back to the beginning. Look at David. He's like, what the? What in tarnations? And then there's Joyce cleaning, cleaning her little counter. She's like, hot diggity dang. And look at Warren. 
He's like, yeah, I ate that shit. And then Kate crying. Bendito, okay. It's okay, honey. Listen. Oh, doggy. Ew, who the hell is that guy? I know his trailer smells. And then look at Icky Vicky. <gasps> what a bitch. And then the principal who doesn't do shit. Like, bro, you suck. I don't even know why you're a principal in the first place. And then look at the teacher. Wait, he's still in school? Bro, go home. Don't you have a life? And then Nathan Prescott. The bully. The jerk. The small dick energy. And then a folder of Rachel. Hmm. Thank you for watching. This is Lover of Ladies. And I'll see you guys next week.